Hello budget people and welcome to my channel. My name is She's on a Budget and we are back for another video. In this video, I'll be sharing with you my side income budgets for week one and two of May. So if that sounds like something that you'd be interested in watching, stay tuned. Hey guys so we are back for another video i do hope you are all well as you can see from the title this is going to be my week one and two side income stuffing i didn't get a chance to do last week so i thought i would just show you both of them this week so it is a little bit larger than usual but yeah let's get into the numbers so the first thing that i am going to be going through is my income so i've put both of my figures down here for my income. So in terms of my income this week, I have both weeks one and two for Etsy. So for the first week in May, we had 188.57. Second week, we had 227.37. So I'm just gonna total those up. And that gives us a total of 415 pounds and 94 pence. Okay, so that's the total amount that I'll be using to stuff my envelopes. And then onto my expenses. So I'm going to do my sinking funds first of all. Okay, so starting with my personal sinking fund, I'm going to be putting 10 pounds into that envelope, 10 into my tech. My clothes envelope is also getting 10. So is hair and beauty. So is car maintenance and so is my date night envelope. So in total, I'll be putting in 60 pounds and then moving over to my regular envelopes. So my YouTube envelope, I'm going to be adding 20 pounds to that envelope. If you haven't already watched my previous side income video, I did release my latest giveaway and the giveaway closes at the end of this month, guys. So the 31st of May. And in that video, I will be giving away 25 pounds worth of Amazon vouchers and a binder for two winners. So for two winners, so if you haven't done it already, go over, enter so that you are in with a chance. But this 20 pounds I'm adding in is basically money that I'm adding ready for the next giveaway. And my debt snowball envelope, I am going to be adding in 140 pounds. As I said, sinking funds is getting 60. And my savings challenges will get 55.94. I did miss off my emergency fund, guys. I forgot to add my emergency fund to the list, but I'm also adding 140 pounds to that envelope. So I'm just gonna total these up. And that gives me £415.94, which is the amount that I have as my income. So as usual for my breakdown, we have £415.94 coming in, as well as going out, which leaves me with zero at the end okay so that is my zero base budget all ready to go i'm just going to move on now and stuff my envelopes okay so i have my cash all ready to go in my cash drawer and i also have the change that i need to add to my penny jar so yeah let's get started i'm going to do my sinking fund binder first of all okay so the first envelope that i'm going to put money in is my personal envelope so I'm adding 10 pounds to that envelope. So we've now got 10, 15, 20 pounds in here for my personal envelope. So that's all done. If you watched my previous cash envelope stuffing video, you know that I did go on a little shopping spree. So this envelope is a bit sparse, but we will get it back to where it was very soon. My tech envelope is all the way at the back here and I'm going to be adding 10 pounds to that envelope as well. So I now have 20, 40, 
60, 80, 90, 5, 100 pounds in this envelope. So that is all done. Uh, my closed envelope is back here and I'm going to be adding in 10 pounds. So here's my closed envelope. I also used money from here for my little shopping trip. And we've now got 10, 15, 20 pounds in here as well. So that's all done. Hair and Beauty is also getting 10 pounds. So we've now got 20, 40, 60, 75 in here and then we are on to car maintenance so car maintenance has had a massive hit last month so i'm just trying to add as much as i can to this envelope guys that is also getting 10 i've got 20 40 60 80 100 10 20 so we've got 120 pounds in here now and then for date night, which is my last envelope from here, it is also getting 10. I'm going to take 20 pounds because I don't have any more tens and I'm going to put back 10 pounds from here. We've now got 20, 40, 65, 75, 80 pounds in date night. So that is all done. Okay, so those are my sinking funds all finished and ready to go. I'm just going to add to my side income binder. Okay, so the first envelope I have is Debt Snowball and it's totally empty, guys. I'm going to be adding £140 to it now. So we should have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40. So 140 pounds in debt snowball to get it started. And that's all done. And then I have my emergency fund envelope. So I've got some money in here already. I'm also adding 140 to this envelope. So we've got, we should have 200 pounds, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 82. So we've got 200 pounds in emergency, which is brilliant. I'm really, really trying to add as much as I can to this envelope now going forward. And then we have YouTube. So YouTube is getting... 20 pounds so I've got 20 40 65 in YouTube so this is just going to be added to until I get ready for my next giveaway so that's all done and last but no means least is my savings challenge envelope and I'm just going to take out what we have in here and Guys, we are stuffing two weeks worth, so I'm going to be putting 20 pounds and five pounds, so two lots for my 52 week challenge card. So I'm just going to take 20 and a five, add it to the pile and put this back in. We are not counting this money. So we'll have a nice little surprise at the end of the year from here. So that goes back in here. And then the same with my penny challenge card. I need to cross off 14 squares. So we've got And 
and I've already added them up and it comes to 17 pounds and a penny. So I'm just going to add what we have left over, which is 30 pounds and 94 pence, guys. So here is my penny jar and we are currently standing at 140 pounds and 47 pence. I set myself a little target for May to try and reach 200 pounds. So my aim is to get this to 200 pounds by the end of the month. So it looks like we're gonna be really, really close guys. Maybe I'll have to extend it. Shout out to Erin Bailey and Zoe the Dreamer. I know that you are also trying to reach your goals for this month. So ladies, do keep me updated so that I can give you some encouragement. But yeah, I'm just going to do a time lapse of me adding in my notes first of all. Okay, so we've reached 170 pounds 47. So that is the 30 pounds that I'm able to put in now, which guys, as I said, I cannot believe we are so far now. We're, you know, nearly at the 200 pound mark already. Um, I definitely think I'm gonna smash this target by the end of the month, but that's what targets are for, right? Eh? To try and hit them. So I'm just gonna put my change in. So our 94 pence. And I think that will bring us over the pound. Yep, so we're up to 171 pounds and 41 pence in my penny jar it's getting really really weighty now guys let me know what you've done for weeks one and two for you okay guys so that's all for now i do hope you enjoyed this video if you did please not forget to give it a big thumbs up and if you're new to the channel and you like what you see do not forget to hit that subscribe button and ring that notification bell so you are kept up to date with all of my latest videos and I'll speak to you in the next one. Bye guys.